your mind is this this communication thing that evolves over time. We've inherited so much of our conversation about how we see the world from somebody else. I mean, who decided up was up and down was down? Mm -hmm. Who decided green was green? Really? Who made that decision? Who decided, uh, I'm strong or I'm weak? You bought into something. You bought into those conversations. It's not until you understand that those conversations exist, that they have meaning, but you also control that conversation. Dialogue determines direction. The second you start driving your dialogue in the direction you want to go, you'll be amazed at how soon you'll get there. So the internal dialogue is something you talk about a lot in your book, and one of the things you mentioned is kind of creating a verbal command request for yourself. How do we do that? Well, I, I, I just don't want to overcomplicate it. It's, it's really simple. Keep it short, keep it direct, and have it something that gets you off your ass. It's, it's, it's not, you know, you've got to keep moving forward. It, it could be move forward. Be patient. Breathe. What a great command that would be for most people. <laughs> just you're breathe. all upset. You're all worked out. You're all nervous. Breathe. That could be really simple. That's a great thing. Now, when we talk about the verbal command request, you can say, breathe, please. So maybe you can actually have a better chance of hearing it. You know, when I'm talking to somebody else, we can use the please. We can use kindness in that, that, that command request. Okay? Even to ourselves, take right? Take a second, please. There's a take a second and please, please. So that somebody actually has a chance to hear your request, your command request. So, but more importantly, what I want people to understand, work harder on yourself than you do trying to change other people. Okay? Mm -hmm. Work on yourself. Learn how to make requests of yourself. Learn how to control and command yourself. That's, that's important because that's how you'll get things done. So some of the steps that we can take to develop that plan of action to get things done. Um, do, we, do we write down the small targets along the way toward the bigger target? Of course, of course. We... Yeah, that's great. Nothing, nothing like writing things down. And nothing like thinking about them and actually planning for them and preparing for each individual target. It takes time to get the big target. So take all the small targets. Take those targets of opportunity that exist right now and knock them out of the park. How, how do you start thinking about, oh, what am I going to look at 30 pounds lighter? Ah, great. I appreciate that. It's great. It's a great target. You can visualize that. You can think about that. But now get back to the one thing you're trying to do right now, which is if you don't, if you don't hit the workouts or eat, eating that you're supposed to hit right now or take care of the rest that you need to, to, for your body to recuperate, guess what? You're not going to get there. Nothing happens until you hit the target in front of you. Mm -hmm. you. Succeed with that target, then you get another opportunity in life called the next target or the next second, okay, the next moment. The next day, earn it, earn it, pay the price. Why? Because it costs something. Mm -hmm. We forget about that. If you want to be successful, if you want to have things, are you willing to pay the price? If you're not willing to pay the price, don't delude yourself that you really want to lose 30 pounds. Mm -hmm. Don't. You save yourself some time, sit on the couch, watch Oprah and eat potato chips. I don't know. It's up to you. It's your life. You can waste it or you can make it into what you want it to be. You can get to the end of your life going, oh my God, I wish I would have done this. I wish I would have done that. I wish I would have done this. Or you could say, this is my life. I'm in charge. I'm going to make my life everything I can make my life. And I'm going to earn it and pay the price one moment at a time, one day at a time, one week at a time, one month at a time, one year at a time. That's how you earn the life you want. Pay the price.